horrible today. A volcano in Iceland erupted for the fourth time in three months. A volcano in Iceland erupted on Saturday night for the fourth time in three months, sending a plume of orange lava into the night sky. The Icelandic Meteorological Office said the eruption opened a fissure in the earth nearly two miles long between the Stora Skogfell and Hagafell Mountains on the Reykjanes Peninsula. The office has warned for weeks that magma, semi-molten rock, is accumulating underground, making an eruption possible. Hundreds of people were evacuated from the Blue Lagoon Thermal Spa, one of Iceland's main tourist attractions, when the eruption began, national broadcaster RUV said. No flight disruptions were reported near Kaflavik, Iceland's main airport. The eruption site was several miles northeast of Grindavik, a coastal town of 3,800 people about 30 miles southwest of Iceland's capital, Reykjavik, which was evacuated before the initial eruption in December. Several residents who had returned to their homes were evacuated again on Saturday. Grindavik was evacuated in November when the Svartsengi volcanic system awakened after nearly 800 years with a series of earthquakes that opened huge cracks in the ground north of the city. The volcano finally erupted on December 18, releasing lava that flowed away from Grindavik. A second eruption that began on January 14 sent lava towards the city. Fortified defensive walls after the first eruption stopped some of the flow, but some buildings were consumed by the lava. Both eruptions only lasted a matter of days. The third eruption began on February 8. The eruption subsided within hours, but lava flows engulfed pipelines, cutting off heat and hot water supplies to thousands of people. RUV quoted geophysicist Magnus Tumi Gummensen as saying that the latest eruption was the most powerful so far. The meteorological office said some of the lava flowed towards defense barriers around Grindavik. Iceland, located atop a volcanic hotspot in the North Atlantic, experiences frequent eruptions and is highly experienced in dealing with them. The most disturbing in recent times was the eruption of the Eyjafjallajökull volcano in 2010, which spewed huge clouds of ash into the atmosphere and caused widespread airspace closures over Europe. No fatalities were reported as a result of the recent eruption.